Here with head football coach Steve Johnson. Coach, we get another uh, week to play football, and uh, you travel to Chicago this weekend to take on Concordia. Uh, tell us what you know and how you're feeling after making it in the Division Three playoffs. Uh, fantastic, you know. I mean, just the greatest uh, deal on Sunday. We had a uh, we had kind of a party in CC three thirteen or CC uh, one twenty five, which is a room that we use a lot. And so the guys kind of ganged up in there, and it's a theater type room and. Um, watched it. We only had to wait for six names, and, and we got named, and the guys went crazy and uh, great fun. And uh, you know, coming off a, a, a game on Saturday against St. Thomas, which is or St. John's, which is a just a big rivalry for us, and a, and a really great game. We really respect them and they us, and uh, we just had some uh, great battles and, and great things. So. You know, to end on that win was, was a big deal, and then uh, um, to be able to go on to the playoffs is more than we could have asked for, and, and, and uh, so we're very excited. Yeah, so you draw a Cougar team that really you don't know too much about. Um, obviously, they're seven, eight hours away, but um, and what you do know about them, what can we expect to see in this game this Saturday? Well, we're excited to go down and play uh, Concordia. We don't know them, but we know their league, and uh, we've played people in their league, Concordia, Wisconsin, and some of those guys. And um, it's it, it, it's it's good football. I don't think it's MIAC football week in and week out, to be honest. But they're uh, they've got a real good team of quarterbacks, really a good playmaker, and um, uh, defensively they've got a great nose guard, and they've got uh, they, they've got some good pieces there too. So I think it'll be a great battle, I th a lot of fun. It's it's very fun to get out of our league because our league not not just because everybody's so good but we just know each other so well you know and you know I think we almost could teach each other's plays a little bit and yeah and and, and so to have a few things that you know are good really work well <laughs> you know and Concordia probably feel the same way and and, and so that, that's a kind of a fun thing about playoffs somebody new to play well you talked about on this this opportunity before that it's just a joy to be able to play in these big games and the opportunity for these players to get this opportunity but What's the mentality that you're giving to these guys as they get to walk onto a different football field where they've never played and into a postseason where you've had great success in the last couple of times you've been there? Well, I think that for, for our guys, uh, the one thing that I've noticed, because this is our seventh uh, time going to the playoffs and, uh, and it's probably our 13th game, it's Concordia's first. Uh, incredible excitement. I could hear it in their voices, but they... They don't. They haven't been there too much, and it's, and Holstein is. They've got a lot of work to do, and we're kind of just getting a hotel and uh, you know, getting places to eat, Portillos and you know, and uh, Blue Malnati's and some fun stuff down in Chicago. But they've got a little bit of a tougher deal, even though they have a home game. It's it's really nice for the players. Uh, they've got some work to do this week that that can kind of take you out of that. But the atmosphere of playoffs, the the fact that you made it in is is just terrific. But the one thing that I think is really fantastic is uh, um, that we're practicing. Yes, you know, yesterday we're pl we practiced at Moundsview. Uh, they're kind enough to let us use their field and the lights. Yeah. So you know, we don't have enough daylight to practice here, uh, but we're going to be on turf, and, and we we're getting our young guys, even guys that won't even traffic travel, are getting an extra week or two or three or four right. of of practice and feel and all those different things and I just I just think it's invaluable and you know other teams are kind of you know going on going on to their other things trying to catch up on academics and stuff that we'll have to do a little later right well like we said last week we will hope that we get to do this again next week and we can do this whenever but uh, we'll wish you the best Saturday or noon new new time noon on Saturday and uh, let's go get the Cougars noon on Saturday I hope you're there it uh, should be a great time great